Okay, let's talk a little bit about the Schillings test. Um, this is a figure from your book. The Schillings test is to um, evaluate why vitamin B12 is not being absorbed. And we want to see what's going on in the GI tract. So we give the person an oral dose of the radioactive B12 and a flushing um, dose of non-radioactive B12 to um, get all the binding sites in the liver. We wait about 24 hours and we test the urine. In normal absorption, um, 5 to 35 percent of that radioactive label B12 is excreted in the urine. When that happens, we know that the only problem we have here is actual B12. That's a dietary deficiency. If that result's abnormal, we go to what's called part two. And in part two, we actually do the same thing as we did in part one, but we add intrinsic factor. So uh, we wait 24 hours, we test the urine. If it's been corrected, we know we have pernicious anemia because pernicious anemia is caused from the lack of intrinsic factor. If it's still not corrected, we look at malabsorption. 